everybody, this is Mutt, and uh, today we're going to do a tutorial on how to use the mobiles targeting bar. When you first open the client, you're going to see over here collapse mobiles with an arrow. Let's make some space, and if we right click on it, it's going to allow us to show different dock spots. Most of us like to show the gray, and now I have my attackers. If you click on the arrow, it'll list all the mobiles on the screen, and any, uh, unless it's an attack, you can use this. Also, show say all of your orange if we're in PvP. Now there's some changes you need to make in your settings in order to make this effective. So let's hit escape. We're going to go to user settings. We're going to go to the mobiles bar tab. And it has filters here enabled. You can turn these on or off, which also changes the dock spots. Update delay. This is a nuisance. I have no idea why it's reset preset to one second but I always set it to zero seconds so that it updates quickly distance tw between bars the if you need a lot of space between bars for targeting this will give it to you I like to keep them close together because it takes up less screen real estate select apply select OK now as I move around as new targets come in on in range they'll show up Whenever I ho hover over a target that is in range, it'll give me an arrow. I can turn that off as well in EC settings, but I like really like having it because it shows me where things are. Now this also works with the smart targeting macros, targeting option. If we make a, an action go to targeting scroll all the way down see the smart options now the smart options can be a little odd because they don't they're not as smart as you would think they would be because they don't allow you to filter by type attackable or enemy or what so it's, it's kind of useless. But I did find a use for it. It's just not good. <laughs> Alright everybody. That's it on how to use a mobile bar. Um, from here you can use this for targeting options. Like if you're a bard or a tamer. And you want to select individual targets from here. It makes it a little bit easier than pulling up health bars. That's all for today. Thank you very much. This is Mutt signing off.